It's Willie. Good to see you, man. This movie looks hey, like, it looks like a lot of fun. You know, you've heard all the criticisms of the White House Correspondents' Dinner. To a lot of people, it looks like the very worst of what people think Washington is. It's backslappy. It's the media laughing along with the president while pretending to challenge him by day. Um, what do you think? Has it gotten to the point where it's a little bit absurd? I mean, it, I mean, it definitely is absurd. I definitely hear the arguments about coziness. I mean, the only thing I would sort of counterbalance that with is, you know, this kind of stuff happens all year round. It's not just this dinner. It's just the right. fact that this, this doesn't happen uh, on camera. So, sure, it's cozy, but that coziness exists all around. I mean, my big problem with it, you know, I don't, I don't mind uh, people having a dinner. I don't mind corporate sponsorship. I don't mind parties. I don't mind any of that. What I mind is sort of its rank on Washington's totem pole of events. I mean, it is our number one event, and that seems very weird to me. You know, if it were number eight and the first seven were, you know, a climate change rally or the passage of meaningful legislation or powerful testimony in Capitol Hill. I mean, if that's the stuff that got people in D.C. really excited and, and, and really they really rallied around that, because that's the stuff we're supposed to do in town, right? If, if those were our main events, I would have no problem with this. To say there's nothing wrong with a night of fun and parties and corporate sponsorship and all that. It's just that it's our number one event that I think is kind of embarrassing.